this past Saturday, the Waves hosted the annual PCH Rivalry Cup game against the LMU Lions at home. Both teams desperately in search of a win. This matchup went down to the wire. Starting off early, Michael Thompson hits the early three to put the Waves up 5-0. Following this, Keon Bell off an inbounds pass hits another three-pointer, putting the Waves up 8-3. Max Good calls a timeout for LMU. The Waves look good early. Pepperdine up nine early when Vernon Teal gets the putback and, and incites a nice little run for the Lions, bringing them within seven before another TV timeout. Shortly after the timeout, Lauren Jackson makes quick work of Ashley Hamilton on the defensive end. His laps, Jackson takes the length of the court, takes the contact, and finishes at the cup. Waves go back up by five. With time running on on the Lions in the first half, Teal kicks it out to Ireland, who throws up a three. No good, but Ashley Hamilton pulls down the board, and there you see Josh Lowry upset about something, and that something was a foul call. With confusion on the court, the refs convene. They do deem that there was a foul before the buzzer sounded. Uh, Hamilton did get two free throws. He made both free throws to actually tie the game at 35 going into halftime. The Lions must have felt very good about this, playing very subpar. And the Waves, you know, Coach Asbury did not look very happy there. But both teams ended up coming out of halftime, firing in all cylinders, and this game picked up considerably after the half. Coming off of Corbin Moore's screen, Michael Thompson takes it strong to the rack, putting the Waves up 48-45. to With the lead continuing to seesaw, Ashley Hamilton finds Anthony Ireland on the three. Keon pumps out too late. Ireland with the three ties the game at 48. And with the waves up to the Lions find Nick Begme left in the corner. Michael Thompson closes out too late. Three-pointer, LMU up one. And with the waves nursing a one-point lead, Vernon Teal's driving middle. He finds Viney up top. Three-pointer right on the way. Good. LMU leads 75-73 with a minute to go. With Jackson with 21 points already, he tries to save the team here with this nice little drive. It goes down, but the refs call it off. Charging LMU ball with 42 seconds left in the game. Redemption comes shortly thereafter for Jackson when he's fouled on a three-point attempt. He makes all three free throws to put the Waves up one with less than 12 seconds to play. After an LMU turnover, Keon is fouled on the inbounds play, makes both free throws, putting the Waves up three. Anthony Ireland takes the ball the length of the court, however, after this, misses the desperation three, and LMU falls 78-75. The Waves celebrate. Pepperdine moved to 2-3 and three in the WCC play, and they host Santa Clara this Thursday at 7.30 at the Firestone Fieldhouse.